Hello, boys and girls and guys. And who did I forget? This is Stock M, and we are playing on the Minecraft Feed the Beast server. And we have an officially crazy turtle here. Look. Oh, it's standing there. The thing um, ran out of fuel, so returning to the surface. So now it's sitting there. I wanted to, you know, stand on top of it to harvest it and <laughs> get it back, but you can't. As soon as you get near to the thing, it freaks out and hits you. Why is it still in mining mode? That's what you ask yourself. Ow. So, let's see if we can get it in mid-air. Ow. We got it. Lost my brain. Yep, I gave it a good name, right? <laughs> ha. So, yeah. I've been, I was hoping the thing would have dug out the whole place, but we are not quite there, but, oh, skellies, keep you cool. If we check downstairs, that is done, that is done. It was done quite a while ago, I haven't picked up the turtle. There it is. And if you run around in here now, as it is super void foggy, I can't have pot lights because I can't break the bedrock, but everything that was formerly known as maze is now gone. It is really cool. Get this turtle back. Let's see. Okay, actually, let, let me see. Uh, refuel. Check. Uh, he's got some some fire. That's good. Let's pick up our ender chest here. and let's get out of here. Here's a some some small rests. I will take them out by hand. I was doing some more tests with the turtles. They got some cool, pretty cool new functions. But before we keep on talking about that, let me quickly set this one up here. Whoop. Is that the right one? Maze weirdo. No, no. We need we need we need maze weirdo on the job. Come here, Mace Weirdo. Yeah. There you go. Come here. Okay. Excavate. Excavate. One. Oh. Yeah. It's lagging. 112. Good boy. Do your thing. I hadn't time to check back. All you guys know, we did the UHC and... That was an overnight session for me again. Jeez, man, <laughs> no sleep for dog. So then today I was trying to catch up on SimCity episodes. Managed to record five, which is a good thing. Mm, and then, what the heck? I need to catch up on Rome Total War now. And then I'm up and running again, halfway in the loop. And I can start producing again. Now it's super stressful. Plus YouTube is a bit borky again lately. You know, the uploads take ages, it freaks me out. And yeah, one thing I want to show you, I extended the cell here, upgraded one of our solar panels. It took me a while to do that. It's an ultimate hybrid now. I mean, <laughs> it's ridiculous what you need for this stuff. Anders was helping me out a bit again, giving me some, some of the materials I need, especially the iridium and stuff you need for it is a bit tedious. But we have this thing now, and this is total overkill, insane overkill. <laughs> and here we have a biogas engine, just trying it out, and it's a pretty nifty setup actually. When I flick the lever, um, the machine below, that is an electrical engine, goes off, and the biogas engine on top um, starts and is feeding the fermenter here. And thus we can produce more fuel with the bio generator which is hooked up and also of course the biogas engine. I'm just trying out things but we don't need energy at the moment. Those things are full. One of these ultimate solar panels is ridiculous. Here this is also something that's pretty neat. Um, you guys suggested that in the comments and it was a very good suggestion. One second. Okay was a very good suge suggestion. Those are, I think, of SciCraft. They are called Glass Viewers. Um, here they are, Glass Viewer. 
can quickly look up the recipe for it. You can see iron in glass and <coughs> yeah, iron no problem for me. This barrel is full, I assume <laughs> quite a lot fell on the floor. Um, I will collect it in a more proper appropriate way of course soon. We had some trouble down there, I will talk about that. As well, I made iron tank walls um, you know, and iron um, tank ga gauges and um, I think also some valves, yeah. And we will set up some iron tanks. I was trying that out. Sadly, you know, they have a certain size you can only use. It's 3x3, three 5x5, three, five by 7x7 five, seven by seven, and here we have 4. It would I would have loved to have them up in there. That would have looked cool, but I tried it. Sadly, didn't work. Um, so we have to place them somewhere else. So I was thinking maybe in a centralized spot here. I also added, <coughs> excuse me, some more maze blocks to make the thing look better. And generic just joined. Hey. And yeah, all cool. All cool. I think I like the look. The glass viewers are really cool. I think you guys uh, would want to use them as well in some of your builds. And they're fairly cheap to make. You know, if you have an iron farm, you don't have to worry about that at all. Talking about iron farm here, real quick, let's have a look what I've done now. Ah, luckily, one guy just fell in. Perfect. Um, we had trouble here with the quicksand and I uh, was trying it out adding another layer of quicksand to see if, if it fixes it and I assumed the problem was uh, mobs bumping into each other and thus pushing um, each other out of the danger zone so to speak and glitch into the glass and thus not suffocate. I also tried solid blocks but it didn't help that much. So um, after all I said okay then let's go back to the lava blade. Good old lava blade. Those lava blades and iron golems really work nice together uh, in survival Minecraft but also here in Feed the Beast as you see we have the lava ex um, extended or expanded better say. Let's go to hover mode. Um, right there. Expanded in midair and signs to hold it up. If the iron golems die all the iron will drop down, nothing will burn, it will always drop with from their feet so you don't have to worry. And below that I just, you know, for the sake of it, because I think it looks really cool, I use these um, obsidian pipes in combination with some iron pipes and the iron pipes are arranged in a way uh, that no items, you know, um, jump up because when they do that, when they go up through the void pipe, uh, obsidian pipe, excuse me, they could actually jump into the fire and burn. But this way, as you can see, they can only go one direction. If it comes down here, it can go only this way, but not over here because it's blocked and so on. I will stare at it a second in case you want to replicate it. Just flip around your iron pipes a bit. And then we go up here, um, have a small filter at the moment, flowers and iron, of course, and just bring it up with the gold pipes because, yeah, we also have a lot of them from the XP a farm we have that also produces a lot of gold and yeah I think it looks pretty cool the setup we have down below and I think we can really work with that so um, what I will do as well of course I will keep on working here on the expansion of the building the roof um, but I don't want to have it like uniform um, you know I will have kind of sections now we got this section now we want to maybe introduce a bit of a different shape here maybe more head clearance you know this is already pretty good it is giving this kind of um how would you call it like in a mech in a big factory you know they have these glass roofs and very uh, let's say practical buildings you know not very, very smug and, 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 and looking awesome. It's just practical. You need space and it needs to be a roof. And maybe, you know, if you're a nice employer, you have some toilets for your workers. <laughs> so that's what I'm gunning here for. But still, we want to have a smooth look. And I think the color combination really goes well. I like it a lot. The wood blends in nicely with the maze blocks and the snow. Here, the maze blocks on the floor also look cool. I like these ornamentations we got going on. So, yeah. It's pretty cool. So the next question is, and maybe you guys, ah, we, we see some iron dropping here. <laughs> maybe you guys can help me out with that. Um, where do we put the tanks? Keep in mind, it has to be an odd number. So here in the middle would be an option. 
I was thinking maybe back behind here, you know, pretty huge tank right there for biogas production, which we're gonna do with our slimes, li like I explained. So, sounds like a plan. What else? I have lots of plans and lots of things to do, and I've got some good things prepared. I want to show you something fairly cool. Um, let's get up here. I have another turtle sitting here waiting for us to demonstrate something. There he goes. Let's put Lost My Brain in there for a bit. And you know why he's called Lost My Brain? Because when I logged back into the server, he was just sitting there and lost all his functionality and for s no reason. So I had to reprogram him and everything, so I called him Lost My Brain. Um, this is a resupply station in combination with a resupply mining turtle. You have to make a resupply module and that's you stick to your mining turtle and the resupply station is made like that with one of these resupply modules which are made like that. Not too complicated, so not too expensive. And these things are really cool. I want to use this turtle and we should go to the twilight to demonstrate. Um, let me first grab a few build blocks here. We need that. Um, this can be stored, this can be stored. 21. Okay, this can go in there. This, this for now, those, those, them. Just free up some space. We'll come back later and sort this chest. Okay. Hey dog, what have motus? Trap doors. I think. Um, hopefully that was correct. Um, what do they want it to do? Yeah, pick up build blocks, don't distract me. Anything more easy? Doors. <laughs> Boat. Okay, so let's grab some build blocks. Build blocks, build blocks, build blocks. Here, cobble gonna use cobble for demonstration purposes. Okay, rush over. Uh, um, wait, wasn't it wild gra grass? Get it with shears. I think. Man, don't over... I um, can't... I can't uh, multitask. Don't <laughs> kill my brain here. I want to demonstrate something. Let me through. It does nice. Thanks. Thank God. Okay. Now that is sorted. We are here. We wanted to demonstrate stuff. This mode is a little dancing guy icon. Oh jeez. Look it up. <laughs> <laughs> little dancing guy icon. icon. Okay. Um, our turtle here should be digging. So we don't want to try it out here. By the way, over there I set down the spawner for beef. So let's do this. We need one block here. Turtle. Set it here. Left to the turtle, we need to uh, put our resupply station. You will see why in a second. In this resupply station, we're going to put some cobble. And in the turtle, we're going to put at least one. So now I'm going to call up my epic builder program, Bauarbeiter. <laughs> yes, indeed. Hmm. This is a very cool build program or build script for the turtle. Yep, ShapeMaker 1.4 by Michael Vlecki Aiolon Propi Caridos. Yep, with resupply mode. Shoutouts to you guys, great work. Of course, as usual, um, if I find it, <laughs> but I will. Um, put the computer craft link in there so you can get the paste bin and all. So, this thing can build all kinds of stuff. It can build lines, squares, you know, all kinds of stuff. Um, you want to try out a wall. You can even make rooms, spheres, circles, everything. It's really cool. So, wall. You want to do a wall. Building a wall. A little. You can even build a wall double, triple L. Okay. So if you say you want to calculate the cost, it will not build it, but you will see how much you need. You will only build a small wall, so we don't want to calculate the cost. No. Okay. 
building a wall um yeah great uh wall again no such program what did happen wait a second <coughs> normally it asks you what kind of wall i think it was because i i called it wall -a -l 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 -l. okay again bauarbeiter wall do you want to calculate cost no Aha. Uh -huh. Please put a building block in first in the slot. We've we messed it up. Okay. Ha. How long does it need to be? Let's say twenty. How high does it need to be? Three. Bam. And off he goes. Making a wall. You have to keep in mind I started him here centered because he will go down one block. But yeah, now we got a turtle that will build stuff for us. And yeah, it's it's just working fine. So why do I want to have that? Well, of course, wait a minute, when we have dug that out, it needs to look snug. We don't want to have this, is this my new word, snug? Do you even say that? <laughs> I hope so. Well, you know, when we have dug that thing out, we definitely want to have it look cool. You know, so that, that means um, when we're done with the digging, we will build in walls again on the outside. All the way around and, well, it will be probably a cobble wall or maybe we can cook up something else. Um, Lol, it was built up in a dress. What the heck? <laughs> uh, but we will use this bad boy over there to do this for us and we can let it be done automatically. The thing is still, you know, to dig this out, I could have used a filler or whatever. But I'm just obsessed with the idea of having it uh, yeah, done with all the turtles. It's just for a good cause, because turtles died in here. And you guys commented about that last time. And what happened was, of course, there was these explosive traps in that thing. And one of these must have blown up and exploded the turtle. So I tested it. It didn't look like a turtle can activate a tripwire. But what could have happened, maybe push the mob in one of the trip wires that triggered somehow I thought I had removed them all and then you know turtle just got blown to smithereen and that is exactly what happened thanks a lot you know for you guys um, letting me know but yeah that is what happened so sadly we lost this turtle but the turtles will take revenge and will just take down this freaking maze and that is the goal so we will use the wall builder here um, I want to try out some more shapes with that thing. It's really interesting because, you know, making spheres, maybe we can use them to let it uh, build some interesting structures in our main base area. So that is really, really cool. I like these. I like, th I like these turtles. They're pretty awesome. And especially with the new expansions. Good told me that was new now kind of linked to that resupply station now I think let me let me try um, Bauarbeiter please put okay when it stopped okay I'm on it I'm doing it what are they talking about <laughs> I need to focus can't read okay left of it mm-hmm and now, enter to continue. Good. Um, we, a platform, a rectangle, a pyramid, a room. Hmm. A stair. That's cool. Let's build a sphere. Sphere. Want to calculate the cost? No, 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 we are not interested in that. What radius do it do I need to be? Do um, we need to to be? Let's don't go crazy. Radius three. I've got stuff in the resupply station. Mm-hmm. They are linked now. Now he's on it. Let's see what he's doing. Okay, 
building a nice starting platform. Just want to see if this thing is working nicely. But looks good. Maybe in the meantime we can turn on the sound again a bit. Okay. Very nice. Build a sphere for me. It's brilliant. I'm loving it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, I'll put down a little cut. And I will be back when he's done with the sphere. Alright. Mm -hmm. Our Bauarbeiter is almost done. Making his sphere here. Oh well, yeah, it's the best you can do, kind of, with a radius of three. It's theory. That was a difficult word to say. Props to me. Theory. <laughs> Maybe that's not even a word that exists. But cool. He made us this little cobble cube here. <laughs> Pretty neat. I like you. You are cool. Cool little fella. <laughs> Pretty interesting. Where's the turtle? Over there he is. Oh, what the heck? What are you doing here? You are the specimen we don't want. We want the maze, guys. Yeah, and of course I will also use this turtle to let me build uh, the slime farm. But before I do that, I of course want to have it all dug out. That was the goal. Dug out and then set the thing up, make walls, and maybe I'll just build the blaze uh, maze, slime farm, blaze maze. Blaze maze? Do they exist? Maybe I'm going to build a slime farm just myself then. Don't have to do it by turtle hand. But this thing can make a room for us, you know. Why not? B double O left the game. All right. Cool. So, okay, guys, I think we're on to something that is going out here, uh, go turning out nicely, going out. I'm going out of the portal into another world. Um, I need to grab this one turtle here. Where are we? Here we go. And I will rush to the nether now. Maybe we can quickly go back to spawn. Is the... No, it is still there. The weird hit hitbox is still there, by the way. Yeah, we will rush towards the nether and I will refuel the turtle here for a really big amount of lava so we make sure the thing digs it out until next time. And I'd say, call it an end for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Please make sure to hit that like button for me. You know, the drill helps me a lot and always makes me happy when I see a good rating on the videos. Little pat on the back, you know the thing. Okay, thanks a lot guys. See you next time. Bye bye. Yeah.